A gas station clerk is killed on the job 18 hours later. Deputies are still looking for a suspect. Good evening. Thanks for watching News Channel 9 at 6. I'm Calvin Snead. I'm Kim Chapman. It's a story we've been following all day long now in Woodfield County. News Channel 9's Jerry Askin is back from Dalton now with advice from a nearby gas station clerk about the dangers of working the overnight shift. Jerry. Hey, Kim and Calvin. We are still waiting for deputies to give us a sketch of this suspect. Today, we learned the clerk was only at work for six hours when the robbery and apparent stabbing happened. We're also finding out there were several customers in the store when this all happened. It was very scary, believe me. It's like, I can't describe like how much scared I was this morning. Abbas Saeed still can't believe deputies found the body inside this Cancun's convenience store on Airport Road this morning. It's only a block away from his gas station. If they come and they want money, we can give them, but like, you know, why do kill people? And family and friends say the clerk was working here alone last night and he's known by the name Dickie. A family friend tells us Dickie was 36 years old. He says a man walked inside the store last night, demanded money from the clerk, and eventually stabbed the clerk in the neck several times. And just down the road, store clerk Abbas Saeed is in disbelief. It's why he says he carries protection, particularly when working overnight, and takes extra precautions. Like our boss says, like every time, like, you know, if it is more than 100 bucks, we try to drop it in. We don't keep as much as money, and if somebody comes, just give them what they want and try to be safe as much as you can. A number of customers were inside the store when the apparent stabbing happened. I started stopping there last night, but I didn't. Uh, stopped across the street to Kangaroo. I'm kind of glad I did. Jeff Williams told me it's a sad reality having to protect yourself everywhere you go, even on the job. You can't, can't even work a job anymore, you know, without having to worry about getting shot or losing your life, to give you life or to make a dollar for your family. And deputies need your help tracking down the male suspect. Any info you have, you ask to call the GBI or the Whitfield County Sheriff's Office.